Happy Friday. Don't be blinded by the North Star. True North. Anyway, I had to acknowledge it because I'm sure you see it. Because um, I see it. We can't save our ass and our face at the same time. I think that's uh, poetic and uh, right on the money. I mean, a permanent solution to a temporary problem, suicide. Um, this too shall pass. There's cycles and I've known people uh, who have died, uh, some have committed suicide, some OD'd, uh, which is a slower form accidental suicide. Um, and I have compassion for those people who feel they can't ask for help. But what does that say about us as a society, as a world, that we create, we have created a society that perpetuates an ideal that we can't ask for help, that you're weak if you do, that the outside is more important than what's going on on the inside. Um, the amount of courage, strength, vulnerability, and tenacity to walk through the hardest of times is admirable and is a common journey. Every, the idea that we are so unique that nobody will understand us is, is, I think, an illusion. We all have such similar bells and whistles that go off in our head, some to a different extent, but to acknowledge that they're there. Oh, I hear this voice and that voice and... The importance of our community to be able to support us and that we feel more, we feel vulnerable or allow ourselves to feel vulnerable enough to talk about what's going on between our ears. Because if we can't do that, we get isolated. We think we're terminally unique and the only solution seems like ending it. The irony of opening up and asking for help is that you allow someone else to participate in your healing. Giving you help, you allow someone else to be of service to you. And not at, we, it's, yeah. I don't know. Just the illusion is that the moment you're feeling right now is going to last forever. The good is going to pass, and the bad is going to pass, and the good is going to pass, and the bad is going to pass. It's not fair. So the good may last for two seconds, and the bad may last for five years. That's and that's uniquely different for everyone. It might not last five years. It's like, I don't know. And there are solutions. We have chemical things that we can take, but the chemical solutions are not to be used in tandem with the chemical self-medications because then it doesn't work right. You're taking some sort of antidepressant while medicating yourself. The antidepressant is not going to work anywhere near the way it's supposed to if you're drinking and doing blow all night. I don't know. I'm just one guy. But I've seen dark days. I've been down those dark days. And luckily, something allowed me to see the light. And it was and that light was not necessary. It was in me, but I saw the reflection in somebody else, and I was able to ask for help. And it was probably the hardest, best thing I've ever done in my life. 
I need help. There's no shame in asking for help. I did it. And I, believe me, I feel that sometimes in, in the day-to-day -day life. And I'm not, I'm crazy, but I'm not down this dark hallway of depression. But I, yeah, I don't know. You're not alone. That's an illusion. Nobody understands you. That's an illusion. You're not that unique. That's the truth. Much love.